Okay, well I worked some more with the uh, little miniature stubble fill coil and wound more layers on it, about three, three or four more layers on that, and was able to pull the battery out of the circuit and uh, made a new rotor that was uh, a little bit different that uh, worked a little bit better. And you see there's a pin on the bottom and a needle up at the top here. And the way this works is it hangs by the needle and the pin on the bottom attracts. And see that little light going blink, 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 blink there? That's blinking off of the uh, back spike of that coil right there. That's my little booster coil. And this is running now. See that little light going blink, 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 blink. And now there's no battery in it. I pulled the battery out. It's just a stubble fuel coil making this run. And uh, this was successful. Um, I just, uh, I was running it without the booster coil. But it's so much faster with the booster coil, I decided to, to leave this in the circuit. And this is this um, hot rod stubble field circuit that has the booster coil right here. And I was adding the power in here yesterday with the little battery, and now that's gone. It's just the power from the galvanic action in the stubble field coil that's causing this to work. And uh, run. So anyway, it's successful. I've uh, enjoyed this little project, this little uh, miniature stubble field coil. Thanks, Laser Saber. Thanks, everybody, for watching.